Ich liebe es, Probleme zu I love solving problems. The freedom you have to consider questions. Every move has to be optimal, has to be good, in order to solve the problem in the end. Letztendlich das Problem zu lösen. Stephanie Petermichel is one of the leading mathematicians in the field of harmonic analysis. She finds inspiration in the cafes in Toulouse, where she's been doing her research up to now. Her very own recipe for success, she uses a variety of methods from different areas of mathematics. She links milestones such as the Bellman functions with her own field of expertise. The beautiful thing about mathematics, you can do it anywhere. In mathematical research, we try to solve problems. Sometimes these problems are very old. Often a new approach is needed. Sometimes you find methods from other areas that fit really well into our approach, for example, into harmonic analysis. Peter Michel succeeded in creating new solutions and mathematical tools by combining the various mathematical sub-disciplines. In harmonic analysis, the aim is to investigate periodic processes that occur, for example, in nature. This could be vibrations that are broken down into their most elementary components. Real processes such as acoustic signals, the oscillation of a bridge or radio waves are modeled as sinus and cosinus curves. Heat also spreads in oscillations and can be calculated. Peter Michel makes use of the mathematical model of Brownian motion, a fundamental component of probability theory. One step to the right for heads, one step to the left for tails. Several coin tosses in succession result in a random motion and a model of how particles meet and heat up material. Stephanie Peter Michel lives with her French husband and two daughters in Toulouse. You see how the heat propagates. And the steam that comes out, that's another equation. When the water becomes steam. My husband is in applied mathematics, which is very nice. We also work together, and that works very well, because he has a completely different angle, and you very rarely have the opportunity to talk so long with someone who really comes from a completely different direction. We have both benefited from this very much. Besides her husband, there are a few sparring partners for Stephanie Peter Michel in Toulouse, one of the reasons why she's looking forward to her time in Würzburg, where she will take up her professorship at the Julius Maximilians University. The Humboldt professorship is very important because it creates freedom for one's own research and there is the possibility of interdisciplinary work. Her colleagues in Würzburg are looking forward to the arrival of Stefanie Peter Michel, first and foremost university president Alfred Forchel, who has worked hard for her Humboldt professorship, along with applied mathematicians, complex analysts and a circle of colleagues who will ideally complement her in her intramathematical multidisciplinarity. The personal attitude, the motivation of the colleagues in Würzburg is incredibly good, and we are also very happy. Mathematician Stefan Waldmann is looking forward to new stimuli. On the one hand, of course, she has an incredible depth with regard to analysis, but, and I think that's the really decisive thing, she connects this discipline with completely different mathematical disciplines. Stochastics then adds geometry and things like that. This is a very rare feature, I would say, and there I think you can expect a lot of great mathematics. Stephanie Peter Michel brings international flair and several awards to Würzburg. 
She was the first woman to receive the prestigious Prix Salem of the Société Mathématique de France. Together, the aim is to establish an interdisciplinary research center with a junior research group, and with Stephanie Peter Michel as the bridge builder between the different mathematical worlds. You need courage. Sometimes we look at a problem that no one has solved for 30 or 100 years. But now and then we have the right approach and make progress. It doesn't work without a certain spirit of adventure. <laughs>